Congratulations to all those who are being honored. From our 40 student scholarship recipients, to our top 40 under 40 young professionals, to the 40 Mujeres de Ace, featured as co-authors in the Women of Impact book, to the 40 executives sharing the history of ASE in a journal book. And here are some of their stories. My name is Tanya Ramos. I am a student at the University of Illinois at Chicago. Uh, my major is sociology. I'm very passionate about um, the, uh, helping the Latino community. Um, I work for a nonprofit organization where I am located in an uh, elementary school and middle school of low-income um, immigrant families. So a lot of the things that we do um, comes with uh, helping kids know and navigate through the education system and also prepare them for college. So that's kind of where my passion for helping out the Latino community started because it's just a domino effect. Um, you don't realize that the small things that you do add up to a big and contribute to society at a larger scale. My name is Wilfrido Hernandez. I go by Willie. Current position is business management consultant at William Blair. For me personally, it really opened my eyes. I was able to get connected with people that share the same values, the culture, similar stories as in background. So that to me was valuable. Um, in terms of my career, it's opened so many doors being able to connect with ASE. I was able to participate and co-lead a business resource group at a previous company and find one. I was a founder of One Alliance in my current uh, company, William Blair. So it's been very transformational and transformative to be able to learn, but also give back. They are helping out students from a very young age, whether it's high school or college, or even in, as they transition into the real world, providing assistance or scholarships or mentoring, tutoring, coaching, whatever it may be, whatever phase of the career they are. It's just been great to see us. It kind of handles every single step of the way. Hi, I'm Sonia Del Real, president and founder of Third City Consulting. So my story and journey with us, it goes back about 12 years. It was my first time being introduced to a very Hispanic-centric organization. And so um, I was invited to do the program. I did the program and it was life-changing, which was Mujeres de Ace, like for many other Latina women who do the program. It's helped me understand and it introduced me to other Latina career ambitious women. It, humbled me because it was the first time I was in a room with a bunch of other Latina outspoken women. And it was the first time I wasn't the smartest Latina in the room. So it popped my bubble and it introduced me to some of my dearest sisters since then. So it's been a very near and dear cause, both for professional and personal reasons. Salvador Mendoza, a Vice President of Diversity, Equity and Inclusion at NBC Universal. Growing up in Chicago and having spent 15 years at Hyatt Hotels Corporation leading the Diversity and Inclusion Department there, I was introduced to ASE. One of the former leaders, Jose Gomez, uh, was the leader of ASE at the time. He said, hey, I'm leading an organization right now uh, that will be able to partner with Hyatt uh, and help you in what you're attempting to do there in leading diversity and inclusion. So I was looking for a community. I, it's like anything else uh, is a human trait, uh, especially for me, right? I, I grew up in Chicago. I always have seen as a, as a Chicago-based organization, even though now it has grown into a national impact organization. So for me, uh, moving from Honduras to Chicago when I was young, uh, as an immigrant, uh, as I was always looking for ways to get into a community uh, for people that looked like me, that spoke like me, for people that I can collaborate with, for folks that uh, I can help uh, in the role that I had at the company. But more importantly is also that I could learn from. Uh, and that I could rely on and that I could network with. So the why for me, it just became um, a natural way to connect with the Latino community. And even to this day, you know, probably over 20 years later, 
uh, it continues to be. We have encapsulated what it means to be part of the ACE Familia, the ACE Pipeline, a multi-generational and national support network of those more senior in their careers giving back as subject matter experts, mentors, and speakers for those getting started and for those in their careers giving back to our students. With this network and with the help of our partners, this is how we achieve MAS together. Juntos hacemos MAS.